Hi and welcome! In today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to make these beautiful shabby rose designs. This is a super easy tutorial, and all you need is a few things you most likely already have on hand. For this DIY, you will need 4 cups of beet juice. To make the beet juice, just cut up 4 beets and then put them in a saucepan with about 5 cups of water and let them simmer for 20 minutes. Then strain and you are good to go. 6 eggs, 3 shades of pink felt tip markers, and 1 green, a black fine tip marker, a white paint pen, and some vinegar. Once the beet juice is lukewarm, add in the vinegar. Now it's time to get your eggs ready. I'm using a glass loaf pan that I had in my kitchen. And just add in some extra warm water if your eggs aren't completely covered. Oops, you get in there. I checked these after about 20 minutes and I like the light color of them. But if you want your eggs darker, just let them sit longer. Ooh, look how great they're turning out. These are going to be perfect. Look at that speckled one, so pretty. So now I'm going to show you how to color in these super simple roses. I'm using three shades of pink. First, I'm making a circle with the lightest color. Then I'll start going over that color with darker shades to give the roses more depth. I like making roses like this because it's super easy, they're really whimsical, and anyone can do this. They remind me of like a garden tea party. So pretty. Now take your fine liner and draw a circle and keep going until it gets smaller and smaller. And that will make your rose. And now I'm just adding in some leaves in a pale green color. And just continue your pattern making larger roses and smaller ones to cover your egg. And now I'm just dabbing on some white paint just for some extra accents. I like how the white pops against the pink. I hope you enjoyed today's tutorial. Till next time, take care.